38 minutes past 9 o'clock. If you guys have just joined us, this one is called a television for the radio show. I go by the name of Theodore Rams. In the background playing is a song called Body So Deep. It's by Nini Ola. Before this, I played you a song by Burner Boy called Anybody. Now, check it out, yo, Mervon. Sure. Check it out, your father's kid, right? Mm-hmm. We chilling with Flame, right? And, like, he dropped amazing. Like, it's, it's timeless, right? It's yeah. a project that I feel like it's on repeat on everyone's ears, especially on campus, mm-hmm. right? I don't know what y'all's favorite song is in the room, right? I don't know about any of y'all, but my favorite is Late Nights, right? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh, pay Respect. You just jack me right there. I'll, <laughs> pay, I'll get another one. <laughs> pay Respect. I'll get the next one. You listen to the story. Right? Yeah. What's yours, Mervyn? Before we even get a flame, bro, what's your favorite on Candy Man? Shack it up, a flame. Like I just win the lotto. Uh, yes. <laughs> what's yours, father? Same, same. All right, man. Listen, we chilling with flame uh. in the cut. What up, bro? Welcome back to the show, man. Shut up, bro. How, how's it going? Hey. I can't even hear myself. Is this mic on? <laughs> <laughs> it's on, man. Maybe, should you I take sure? it louder? Let's do uh, it. Yeah, that's, that's, that's do great. a live that's, changing that's, of the mic. Yeah, yeah, you you chill, it. bro? I'm nice. What's popping? I'm, I'm easy, bro. Sorry, you dropped I'm Candy late, Man. man. I so care, bro. <laughs> I understand. Look, you dropped Candy Man. Yes, sir. And, and last time you were here, we spoke about it. And you were working towards Candy Man. Mm-hmm. And you dropped that night. The name is Candy Man. And mm-hmm. people went back. I think after that day, bro. That was a legendary day for me. And I feel like after that day, something happened. Talk to me about it. I honestly feel like that was like step one. It wasn't really like the day, day, day. I feel like the day that is going to come is going to be like, I don't know. The whole game has to shut down and just change. (laughs) For real? I got to be the man of every, like, I I just got to be the guy. Yeah. That that dude, everybody looks at like, okay, we can do everything, but let's not go to that man. That man is just danger. That's what I'm I'm looking into. Bro, so but that's, this is just step one. All right, for me, it feels like already, bro. We already the game is in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> you got it right, actually. With that, they are in trouble, <laughs> but they haven't got what they need to get yet. Yeah. So I really haven't given them what they really need to hear from me as much. I like I just said, this is my first project. Yeah. I just started, man. It's still, you know, I'm still I'm still jogging. I'm not I'm not in a rush. <laughs> yes, 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 what I feel. I feel like a whole lot of rappers were planning on dropping this year. We went back to the drawing board. You yeah. Know, a whole lot of rappers were like, <laughs> yeah, hey. they did. <laughs> they did. Yeah. And whoever dropped before me played themselves. No, don't, 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 <laughs> don't get there. Don't get there, please. Let's talk no, about that's honest, you know. Like, if whoever that dropped hey, before hey, me hey, 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 played hey, themselves. Hey. If you <laughs> drop, it. if you drop in after me, then at least you got some time to work on your stuff. But yeah, to if, match it. Not even they gotta try and hit it like yeah. they gotta switch everything up. Everything in there is like nothing that's ever been made in South Africa. I listen to to the whole thing, and for me, I like to listen. Like I don't don't give me a single and say yeah, listen to Candy Man. Yeah, yeah. Like, listen to everything from yeah. A to Z. Yeah. Um, I like the fact that in your music you're very vulnerable, you're very honest. Yeah. People don't know you, but people know you. Do you get what I mean? Because that's, of your music. That's the whole point. If if you're not vulnerable, then what are we relating to, bro? Like, yeah. We can't, there's nothing to relate to. Otherwise, you're going to be that artist that's hot for a certain moment. That's it. Boom. you out. Where were you when you decided, okay, it's dropping now? <laughs> Where was I, bro? <laughs> I was at the crib. That, we're at the crib. Yeah, we're, we're just chilling at the crib. We uploaded, and then that was it. <laughs> so far, the reception has been absolutely lit. Yeah. Um. Did it exceed your expectations? Honestly, not yet, but it's getting there. It is getting there. Well, okay. Let me just say, yeah, it did, but not in a sense of I'm like you know I'm over myself and all that. I'm still humbled by everything that's happening, and I I know where it could go. Yeah. And I'm trying to take it there. Murphy. Yes, sir. Uh, like you know, speaking of of Candyman. Yeah. Compared to to Cloud. Yeah. There is a there is a lot of changes, I guess. Yeah, like major changes. Major changes. Yeah. Can you tell us about the growth from Clouds to, to Candyman? Um, it's simple. On Candyman, okay, let me start from Clouds since yeah. you know we're taking it step by step. Uh, with Clouds, I was uh, like, I was still vulnerable, you know. Yeah. On Clouds, I let people know how I'm feeling. It was just yeah. like. With me, every project I do is like a piece of me and what I'm going through at that time. So it's like more or less my current state of mind at that time. Sure. So I don't, I'm don't. i not the type of dude that's going to go into the studio and just record one song and be like, yeah, I'm about to drop this so that people can understand what yeah. I'm going through. Because it feels like, yo, man, we, everybody does that. Like yeah. we can all drop singles all year and it's just going to be like, all right. But what really like... 
we have like over a million rappers. Yes. What <laughs> what difference yeah. like what 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 makes you different, different from, from out of rappers. all million? Yeah. What makes you deserve to be the best guy out of all of that? And I feel yeah. with me it was just the just pure honesty in just my music. Honesty. Like I've never like I always put like as an artist, like I said before. I think I yes. said this on in the first interview. You just got mm -hmm. as an artist, you gotta always put yourself in a position where you always got content. Yeah, yeah. you feel me? Whether it's good or bad, it's so, content. If you're heartbroken, yeah. it's content. Yeah, there's no need to keep it in because yeah. at the end of the day, there's somebody else that's going through that and needs something mm -hmm. to hear. And maybe you got something that's like, oh, I went through a heartbreak and I almost went, you know, crazy. And this is my story. Yeah, yeah. So somebody I can relate to that and feel like, oh. I'm not stupid. I'm not the only one. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Yeah. Okay, now, okay, I'm I'm starting to get happy. I'm starting to see things yeah. way different now. I'm getting, I'm falling in love, all that crazy stuff. Yeah. Some sure. some people are going through that too. Like, yeah. you got to always embrace whatever you're going through, whether it's bad, whether it's great. You just got to oh, appreciate what speak, it is. You speak yeah, so I feel music, like, speak for you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because also me, I listen to artists that don't, they ain't scared of like, Telling the story yeah. on life, like they just tell you what it is, what and that's how I, I can relate yeah. to their story. So, and it's still yeah. touching on that. Why the name Candyman? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, is candy like in, in place for something? Like, is candy supposed yeah. to mean something else? Maybe? Oh, yeah, like, yeah, it is. Yeah. Why, why Candyman? <laughs> yeah. Not Hitman, since it's flame. Ah, uh, uh, Hitman. Like, okay, Candyman. Okay, why? So why would I call myself Hitman sweet. though? Like, that's, <laughs> I feel like that's very typical for yeah. a, for a guy to say Hitman. Candyman. First things first, it was like you know, um, I'm in a space where I'm I'm in a good mood right now in my uh -huh. life. And uh, besides a good mood, you know, like yeah. I'm just human. I go yeah. through my, I go through my, you know, ups and, ups and downs as well. I go like I'm happy, I'm sad. It's always, it's just a mix of emotions. So I feel like that's a whole lot of colors put together. You feel me? Sure. So all those colors put together just put me in a position. Where I just felt like, yo, no, let, let me just be the candy man. I mean, if you bump into the candy man today, if you go there and try and get some lollipops or something, you are gonna get different flavors, right? Yeah, yeah. that's what I was giving y'all. Oh man. crap! Damn! Damn. Now make. <laughs> Just had to put that one out there. Yeah. yeah. Your so I have like two questions to ask. Would you compare Candyman to any of the other projects that you did prior to it? Nah, and I no. wouldn't actually. But it does get to me, honestly okay. speaking. It does get to me. But I wouldn't because I'm not the type of guy that, you know, goes into the as much as life is about competition, whether you co you're in competition with yourself or you're in competition with anybody with me, it's just like I live for the moment. Okay. Basically. Second question. Yeah. I am an Instagram freak. So <laughs> I looked through everything SA Hip Hop to keep up with what's happening. And right. I saw there was an interview where they asked you about a, a feature with the Reese. Yeah. So just for the listeners and everyone who's curious, I just want to ask you to touch base if you don't mind on what's happening between you guys and the whole career and the songs and everything honestly speaking i don't i'm not attached to nobody no more like i'm at a point where i don't care about nothing no more by myself okay so whoever's riding with me is gonna ride if you ain't riding stay where you at i, I don't need it. no energy that's gonna block me from doing what i want and what i love bad energy stay far away okay got it got it because I, I feel that i touched on it really like because everyone was just like yo yo you know what's happening and everyone actually everyone was comparing obviously flame with like the fact that Reese also dropped this year. Yeah. Yeah, and I hate that because I'm, I'm, you know, like, it's yeah. not about that. Right. It was never about that in the first place. You feel me? So for people to put us in that position is kind of like a stretch because now you got to be looking up. Now you, it's statistics. Wings. Compare. Yeah. Now it's like that's, statistics that's all, that's and stuff. You feel me? Like, you know and we don't need that. From the first go, we never had nothing like statistics yeah, where yeah. we're like, oh, we like this guy because he's a better rapper than this guy. Okay. Now nah, we just like you because you can make better music, bro. Yeah, that's, that's the whole plan. Like, yeah. that's the whole point. If Reese can make good music, if you don't want to listen to it, it's, it's fine. It's you cool. Nobody's yeah. got a gun on your head to not yeah. listen to him. If I'm making music and it's great or yeah. bad and you feel like you don't want to hear it or you want to listen to it, it's still it's, on you. It's all your choice. Nobody got a gun on your head. Yeah. So I don't really, like this comparison stuff is not for me. Yeah. So I, I, I really just don't pay it no mind. Every time I see it on, either on Twitter, bad. Instagram, I just, you know, you know how you, you just scroll down, man. Yeah. <laughs> just scroll down and look at the happy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Happy, happy meals. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you you have 
quite a lot of features on 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 mm-hmm. on the tape on the project and i feel for one you know some of the features came as a surprise to people let's talk about some of the features that you got on there that you think people didn't expect which one is that for one like i, I didn't think you'd put hash on hash Same. yeah come on man like me and hash are boys like these how can i not have a song with hash bro <laughs> like it don't make no sense like I put hash on, there's no way I cannot make a song with hash. Yeah. For me to just put an artist up on my Instagram and say, "Yo, man, go listen to this guy." Yeah. I'm already a fan, and for me to want to work with you, I gotta be a fan first. So me and hash like have so many more other songs in the vault than Copy. just that one. For real? Yeah. Like there's gang songs. And then in terms of like, I was actually also supposed to be on circles. Oh yeah, yeah. Yo, and then man, uh, probably that's coming. Yeah. Nah, the thing is, nah, I, I'm not jumping on it no more. But I might, we might just go back into the studio for his album and yeah. stuff. Yeah, but yeah, with Hash, it was like for me not to get on circles. What happened was, um, he was focused on finishing Young, and I was still in the process of Candy Man. Yeah. So the timing and everything was always bad and stuff. Isn't so, there a remix coming out? Yeah, but ah uh, man. Let him live, man. It's nasty. Yeah, yeah. Let him, oh, let I don't try. think he needs okay. me on it. Yeah. It's fine, you know? <laughs> Some of the other... The, how, okay, how do you choose the people you want to work with? Especially when you're in the game. Because I know most people like, yo, I charge for feature. But I feel like as Flame, like you can't, you can't come to Flame and be like, yo, I thought 35,000. Yeah, me, I'm not that nigga. How do you do it? Uh, It's all about... It's all about passion. And yeah. if I... Like I said, I got to be a fan first. Mm-hmm. I got to love what you do. Yeah. Otherwise, I don't even have... Like, I don't care if you're the hottest rapper in South Africa. If I feel like you're not good to be on my music, then I'll admire your stuff from That's a distance. Fine. It's cool. Like, we don't have to make no songs. It's fine. Like, making songs to me is spiritual. It's not about just making songs and just being that guy at the top. Nah. Yeah. So I'm about to play your song, right? It's called Don't Bother. Uh, right? Talk- my favorite song, actually. Is that, is, that, is, that your, is that your favorite? Yeah, that's my favorite. Damn. Which one is your least favorite? I know that that's a, that's a very weird question to ask, yeah, right? Because yeah. but there's always... My least favorite tip. song yeah. on Candyman. Yeah. Yeah. You're lying to yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were not going to say that. You're playing yourself. There like, isn't. There isn't. Um, well, I do have a couple of songs that I have on my previous projects that yeah. I'd be like hey man I could have done better there or yeah. yeah but on Candy Man like I literally made sure that I don't like even if people are gonna have problems with that song or that other song with yeah. me I just make sure that it's always gonna be like yo man whenever I play this it's like special for me mm-hmm. like I make music that I wanna listen to like I said the first time on the interview the first interview we had so um it's all about that if I can't for me, Candyman was just like, I got to make something I don't mind listening to over yeah. and over and over sure. again. And that's the kind of music that you make. Because even yeah. if you look at Clouds, I can bump Clouds even right now. You feel now, me? Also, day. Clouds yeah. was also... It's but I have a couple of songs that I don't like. I, mean. that. I don't know how Clouds uh, actually became that type of project where everybody's like, whoa, Flame I, I I really? Really like For me, okay, I really pure. didn't like that project because, you know... I felt like I was too vulnerable on that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just a little bit too much. Too yeah. much, yeah. Hey, <laughs> right, man, this one is called Don't Bother. It's by Flame. It goes a little bit like this. It's good. Yes, sir. Don't bother to call and don't text me. <laughs> Just played you guys a song by Flame. He's chilling inside here. It's called Don't Bother. Yes, sir. Right? It's an absolutely amazing song. I got a new man. Do you ever get that, 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 like, Lerato, when you got a new man and you're just telling all the niggas on your WhatsApp to just stop bothering you? You know what the sad thing is? Yeah. You ain't got a man. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> <laughs> and that's what's sad. Yo, bro. You need a, you need a new man. <laughs> it was hard. I see what you did there, bro. Uh, I already got a girl, so. Hey, she, you're nice now. Don't bother, don't call, and don't text me. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking about having a girl, bro, how difficult is it to have a girl in the industry, bro, in the game? As as a rapper, as a well-known rapper, I mean, everybody knows you. Everybody wants to be around Flame. I bet there's your I DMs, bro. I think I'm going I'm to just give you two sentences that are going to... If you don't understand these two sentences, then I don't know how to break it down for you. I think this is the simplest way to drop it. Yeah. Fine. Being single doesn't always mean lonely. And being in a relationship doesn't always mean being happy. Sure. Sure. Crazy. Yeah. Hey. Mm. Somebody, mm. Somebody's writing notes. I know there's somebody out there listening to the show. Who's got like a pen 
and they're writing some, some stuff. Yeah. Visuals for Candyman. Mm -hmm. I'm actually about to shoot tomorrow the first video. Which one? I ain't gonna tell you though. Ah. <laughs> you know me. <laughs> I'm, you the, know, I'm the master yeah. of surprise. So I, you know who's shooting the video you. though? Yeah, yeah you already realist. know. You, you already like, know. You got the realest like. Who? Who's shooting the video? Come on. Come on, man. I Come on, I man. Well, are you guys doing this? It's Tell me around, around, bro. Oh, yeah. You know, the cloud cassette. All right, so that's, so that's all you're giving us. Just know it's cloud cassette and... And when do you think it's going to drop? Yeah. Uh, this week. Yeah. Whoa. 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 For real? Yeah. Wait. I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> the flame is dope with that now. All right, man. <laughs> I think after you drop Kenny, man, there's a lot to change physically. There's a lot to change in your life yeah. mentally as well. Yeah. You know, what was one of the like the physical changes that you realized? Physical changes? Yeah, like everybody's starting to love me now. Yeah. yeah I, <laughs> I had so many haters, bro. Like I was like the black sheep. Yeah, and everybody's starting to love me, and I'm like, whoa! When did we get here, bro? Like now you love me now. Everybody's also. Wherever I go, wherever I chip is yo, flame, we see you. Shoot, shoot, shoot. <laughs> yeah. No, but I feel like that means that's recognition, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Kenny and that's is all doing, I, is doing that's the all work. we needed. Yeah, Kenny that's Man all we needed. Just that recognition. Yeah. And just get it. But you know, like I said, at the end of the day, just me putting out the link onto Instagram and yeah. Facebook is not really enough. I gotta keep yeah. throwing it out there. I gotta, you know, I don't know. And throw some up. physicals, do some, you yeah. know, yeah. groundwork with the fans, you know, yeah. meet up with the fans, do some meet and, and greet. I also heard you say, saying you want to put out a, a couple of vinyls as well. Yeah. For Flair, for, mm -hmm. for Candyman. I'm working on that. And then, oh, let's uh, break a little bit down about the new regime. Uh, new regime yeah. is a uh, record label yeah. by yours truly. Own vinyl. <laughs> My the 19 year old flame for really? you know, yes sir how do we how do we get into that bro how do we say i got a dope rapper who's like really dope and he's uh, trying to like, sign right under now, you right now i'm gonna be honest with you i'm not even trying to sign nobody yeah, i'm at a point yeah. where um you know you gotta before you're gonna start doing stuff like you know i want to sign people because man i already got people that i want to sign but yeah. i just can't because i gotta understand the basics of what it takes to make an artist and what it takes to break an artist true you feel me if i can get the if i can get that into into one piece i can like kill it it's gonna be very simple so with new regime i'm still trying to like put myself up first and yeah. and see if it's gonna work and see how it works well so far what i've learned is for you to like make an artist you just gotta let them be themselves yeah. Okay. Well, and the other stuff is business stuff, so I still gotta learn business like that. So I'm still, you know. So for now, I'm not putting nobody in. Probably for the next coming two years, I won't be having nobody by me. You oh, for real? All yeah. alone. All right. So if you're listening, man, and you think, oh, I'm trying to sign, <laughs> yeah, you ain't and also it's just for like, you know, cutting a whole lot of stuff. Like you know, when you're an independent artist and you have to do a whole lot of ups and downs for paperwork and stuff like that. I'm trying yeah. to like kill all of that stuff to just you know yeah. I can just focus on me basically. Hey man, Flame, look man, we gotta have to cut the interview right now. It's ten no o'clock exactly, <laughs> bro. Before you get out of here, man, from my side, it's classic, bro. Shout out. Um, I, really I don't know where this this project is gonna take you. But I don't see you sitting in South Africa too long, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's the whole plan. I really don't, bro. That's the whole plan. I, I honestly, I don't think you're gonna be here for long. We can't um, be here for long. We you, just gotta go out there and represent. Keep on doing what you're yes, doing, bro. Respect, Respect from outside, from the television, for the radio. I'm still gonna bump your stuff, and it's dope because you know when you meet the homie that you bump <laughs> yeah. it's like, whoa! <laughs> you know? So big shout out to you, bro, Flame. Oh, yeah, um, bro. Before you get out of here, where can they find you? Where can they get the the whole uh, project? I uh, go. Uh, we we number one in South Africa right now. Mm. Yes, sir. Let's know that. We are number one. We hold it down. Did you hear what I said? In South Africa. So I'm, I'm still yeah. putting the country on. Yeah. You feel me? I'm number one. Holding it down for the country. Yes. Go to iTunes. Go to all the digital platforms. Yes, sir. You find it there. It's, over, it's on over like a hundred and some stores. I don't know. Yeah. The other yeah. stores names there. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to take out um the physicals very soon. We just, you know, got to strike the right people and the right deals we ain't trying to be signing our rights off to nobody you feel me hey yeah straight up <laughs> we still up, gotta own 100 of yeah. everything we and um just go on social media it's la flame say on twitter instagram and on facebook yeah i've seen a lot of people get hacked and they get they like they get like fraud stuff yeah. happening to them mm -hmm. on, 
My, I'm not Le Flame SA on Facebook, guys. Please note that down. I'm Le Flame Z A, not Le S A. Yes, get it right. So yeah. next time you're gonna get handled. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> Just know from today it's Le Flame Z A. And yeah, bookings at bookleflame at gmail dot com. And yeah, everything is is gonna be nice from there. All right, man, What's Flame, up? thank you so much for coming through. We about to play a song. It's called Candyman. Watch how the whole studio yeah. is going to lose it. Let's get it. <laughs> hey, she shake it. Flame like I just won the lotto. Her booty big and body beat her like the lotto. Always now, in the morning. You need to love that she puts on makeup and she does her face beats and whatever. They should take a picture and say, hey, they pretty face, I've missed you, right? And then I'm thinking, okay, wait. That means I, you don't mm -hmm. think you're pretty when you have makeup, right? Yeah. But that's not what I want to get into, right? I want to mm -hmm. talk about nightmares, right? Yeah. Because obviously some girls feel like it's a nightmare to look like that without makeup. I want to find out from you, like, do you remember some of the worst nightmares? Yeah, niggas. Oh, yeah.